Um, by the way, always, you know, it doesn't always follow this, but if it's this warm here, unnaturally warm here, it's going to be cold somewhere else. Yeah. So that's when you know if they've got the real cold out west, chances are we've got something better in our direction. And that's exactly what we've got in terms of the temperature regime. But we've also opened the door up to golf moisture. So that jet stream's way up high. And that's allowing for a lot of warmth to come in here. But also, we're tapping into all that moisture in the form of rain. And so flood concerns are with us because we could, through the day today, see upwards of one to four inches of rainfall. It's going to be possible for us uh, by the time this all said and done. We're looking at rain moderate and in intensity coming down through the area right now. Bigger picture is going to show back behind the warm sector of the storm. We've got cold, snow, uh, freezing mixed bag, and this is all kind of moving in our direction. Do we expect to see a lot of it? No. The moisture will be wrapping up just as our temperature plummets. So we're actually going to see just a little period of time late tonight into early tomorrow where we could possibly see a wintry mix. For the most part, it's rain, and for that reason, a flood watch is up through tonight. You can see the rain a little bit better at 11. 30 today, maybe a break in the action a touch, but then it filters back in a little more heftily and we start to see the potential for more heavy rain and then it settles in a uh, sort of light to moderate at about midnight still for northwest Indiana, but you can see this pink right here. That's the rain wrapping up as possibly a bit of a wintry mix. It's gone by the time we wake up uh, Wednesday morning or tomorrow morning. So things are looking better at that point, but we could pick up to three to four inches of rain in the orange shaded areas, a little bit lighter orange or two to three. And it's one to two for everybody else again. So that range will be very different depending on where you are. But the farther south and east you are, the higher rainfall totals you could have from this two day event. 62 the high today. We dropped to 37 tomorrow, and we're in the 40s, though, rest of the week.